Center. And a shakeup for the Cardinals tonight. A player being investigated for domestic violence. Linebacker Daryl Washington suspended by the NFL earlier this offseason for violating the league's substance abuse policy. Now, a woman is coming forward saying Washington attacked her. And Phoenix police say there were clear signs. We stopped by Washington's house more than once today, but nobody was home. So far, Washington has not been arrested. Now, let's throw things over to ABC 15's Paul Calvisi. And tonight, he's talking soccer and the major turning point for one of our Phoenix team pros. You know, only a select few get the chance to ever go pro in their sport. And along the way, many give up. You know, that may have been the case for one Phoenix FC defender if, if he didn't have people to push him along the way. Like most professional athletes, Devin started playing soccer early on, around the age of six. But he gave up the game when he was 12 years old after his club team started going separate ways. When my, my teammates stopped playing with me, kind of the game was over for me. Four years later, he was given an ultimatum that would impact his life for years to come. My dad said either you have to work or you have to play soccer. And so I decided, <laughs> yeah, easy decision. <laughs> From their college call, JC, then Fresno Pacific, after college, a short stint in England, and then a contract with the USL Pro League. But just like when he was 16, Devin may have given up the game again if it wasn't for his teammate, Cyprian Hendrick. You see, these two actually met in 08 when they were both playing for the Fresno Fuego. He stuck out because my team was largely like Latino and I was the only black dude. And so to see, <laughs> and I was to see, a really, really dark to, one in the field. So. so to see him when I walked out there, I noticed him real right away. And that friendship would pay off. You see, in 2012, Cyprian was drafted by the MLS in the second round. Meantime, Devin was left looking for a contract, so he turned his focus away from soccer and began his own business as a website developer. But Cyprian wasn't going to let Devin walk away from the game of soccer. There was too much potential, so the two stayed in contact. Me getting the chance opened his eyes that, you know, I mean, if I can do it, he also can do it because, you know, he's had, he's had a lot of potential. Now you can catch the two of them playing together again, this time playing for Phoenix SC. You know, we're really competitive people, and uh, we just want the best for each other. ABC 15 Sports, I'm Paul Calvisi.